Okay, so I wanted to do the mommy tag. If you can hear my son and the dog in the background, it's because they're running around. So, yeah, excuse that. Uh, so anyway, let's get right into it. Um, are you a stay-at-home mom or a working mom? Uh, currently, right now, I'm a stay-at-home mom. Would you have it any other way? Um, I like staying at home with my kids, but I also like having something to do. So I feel like if I had, I like working, I miss working. So I feel like if I had something part-time to do, then um, I would kind of like it more because it kind of gets, you know, sometimes you want adult interaction during the day and sometimes I don't get that because I'm at home uh, with the kids or with the dog and the kids um, by myself all day long. So um, yeah. Number three, do you co-sleep? Um, we co-sleep with our kids uh, until about maybe a month old. Um, it's mainly usually with like a bassinet or like a co-sleeper bed um, next to our bed. We don't do the whole co-sleeping thing. Uh, number four, one must have gear for baby. That for me would probably have to be uh, our baby sling or um the bouncer or the swing i don't know it's three things but one of those three things i is a must have for me um especially excuse me when i'm at home or doing something um mainly the baby sling because i'm able to move around i'm able to get stuff done and still you know have the baby right with me uh, number five, how many kids do you plan on having? Well, this is my third, so I think that we will be slowing down um, for right now and then, you know, see where it takes us later on in life. But we don't really have an actual number. Um, number six, date night. How many nights or days per month? Um, usually our kids will go to their grandparents every other weekend I would say we'll have them two weekends and then they'll go for a weekend to the grandparents or you know every other weekend it just really depends on the schedule if we have anything planned so for the most part I guess it will be hmm, maybe like twice uh, twice once or twice a month maybe at the most even if it's like just us together hanging out getting takeout and like watching a movie at the house like we try and do something together um, number seven, your child's favorite show. Um, right now my son really likes Spongebob. Um, I don't really know, I don't really know if he has like a favorite show right now. It used to be super Y. Um, but yeah, for the most part, he likes Adventure Time and Spongebob for right now. Uh, name one thing you bought before you had your baby and never ended up using. Um... I don't really think we bought anything that we never really ended up using. We had more than one baby sling, so I guess um, that would that would count as something. I don't, I can't really recall anything that we bought that we didn't use though. Uh, your child's favorite food. Um, my son's favorite vegetable is broccoli. Um, he really loves that. He likes hot dogs. Um, chicken is i guess would be his favorite because he likes chicken nuggets chicken fingers chicken chicken like anything chicken he likes that my daughter i guess our favorite food would be pizza uh, how many cars does your family have currently right now we have two um honda ruckuses and one actual car for now uh, weight gain before pregnancy during after and now well I'm currently pregnant right now so before I was 135 and currently right now I'm 157 and I guess we will have to see um, how much more I gain um, dream vacation with your kiddos uh, I'd like to take my kids to Disney again because I feel like when we when they went before like they were so young that they were just like okay whatever so i feel like disney or sea world or something like that um i think that would be really fun for them now because they're both older and they can you know get what's going on and really enjoy it dream vacation without the kiddos um without the kiddos um anywhere where there's no 
children, peace and quiet, and possibly a alcoholic beverage. Does that count? I don't know. Um, Japan, probably. Um, me and my husband really want to go to Japan and just really go there and be tourists and just really check out the culture and, and everything else. So Japan, I guess, would be our dream vacation without the kids. Um, how has your life changed since your baby has been born? Well, since my two kids have been born, um, things are a lot busier. You know, you always have a child running around. You uh, can't really just get up and go. You have to kind of, unless they're, you know, you have to get a sitter or something like that, you know, before you just get up and go for whatever. Like, it's not really just all about you anymore. It's your kids and then you. So, um, that has been, I feel like, the biggest change. Uh, finish this, number 15, finish the sentence. It makes my heart melt to see my kids actually getting along and sharing with each other and not arguing or something because they're at that stage where eventually they want to wring each other's necks after a while. So yeah, to see them sharing and just getting along and loving each other, that's always great to see. Um, number 16, where do you shop for your kids? Um, uh, pretty much a little bit of everywhere. I shop at Carter's, I shop online, I shop at Walmart, I shop at Target. Um, I thrift, like just wherever I find a good deal and cute kids clothes, that's pretty much where I shop. 17, favorite makeup and skincare products? Um, my favorite skincare product right now, I guess, would have to be my Acne Free, um, cleansing brush and my Clear Cell Face Wash. Uh, cause that's been really working wonders with the acne that I've had right now, um, being pregnant. And then my favorite makeup product is probably my BB cream right now because that is like so easy to just throw on and I can put on a little mascara and just touch up my eyebrows and just be done and still look presentable when I want to have a little bit of makeup on but don't want to go all out. So yeah. Uh, number 18. Huggies, diaper jeans, yay or nay? Uh, I would say nay because we we got those for my son because I just thought they were super adorable when they first came out and he was completely allergic to them. Um, he got a really bad diaper rash every time we put one on him until we figured out that it was the diapers. So yeah, probably no. And plus we're going to be cloth diapering uh, with this baby so that's completely out. Okay. Number 19. Have you always wanted kids? Yes. I have always wanted kids. Um, I think I went through like a brief, quick phase when I was like younger where I was just like, oh God, kids, no. But um, my maternal clock instinct, whatever you want to call it, kicked in pretty early for me. So yeah, for the most part, I've always wanted kids. And number 20, what's the best part about being a mom? Um, I'd say for me, it's just my kids are always doing something that I'm just like, what? Like, they're just little built-in TVs for me. They just run around and they're hilarious. So I think the best part for me is just watching them grow and just learn and hearing some of the crazy stories they come up with and just the little adventures that go on in their heads sometimes and watching them play, like... I think that's the best part for me. Um, it's just watching them grow and just being able to be there with them and see how they're interacting and growing with other people. So that is it for this tag. I will post the questions below. I tag anyone who wants to do it to do it. Um, I will try and get the mommy tag 2.0 up shortly because this is the first tag i wanted to do the first tag so it kind of made sense when i did the second tag so yeah okay so that's it for this video i will see you guys in my next video bye guys